Felix from Michigan Day Oh, hi, Kathy. Hi. So happy to talk to you. Well, the pleasure's mine. Your questions to ask? And I'm recording this, if that's okay with you. Oh, absolutely. Every opening day, you recite what opening day means. Uh, you mean the quote, the uh, quotation? Mm hmm Yeah, uh, lo, the, lo the winter is past, the rains are over and gone, the flowers appear on the earth, the time of the singing of birds is here, and the voice of the turtle is heard in our land. That is wonderful. That is absolutely wonderful. Song of Solomon. Yes, I love that. Yeah. But thank you for that. What does that day mean to you? Well, uh, to me, uh, opening day has always been a great occasion because it uh, it, it really uh, symbolizes, in a sense, uh, uh, Easter and Fourth of July and Christmas. I call it Easter because a lot of people come out only one time like they do yearly in church. And people show up for opening day, they don't come back at all. And it's the Fourth of July because we have a lot of fireworks connected with it, everything everybody's happy and it's also Christmas because the, the people are beginning to open their new presents of the year. We're going to see what kind of a team we've got and, and what's in that surprise package that the Tigers or whatever team you're rooting for is bringing into the season. But it's a great occasion. It's a rite of spring and I think people look on it not only as the beginning of the baseball season but probably as sort of the burst of spring on us here in Michigan. Uh, a little incident that happened last year with a camera 
woman, but uh, that's something that uh, anybody could uh, have happen, you know, when you lose your temper. And I think he's been regretful for that and apologized. So I'm uh, giving them the benefit of the doubt, and the people that know him seem to think that uh, he's a very nice guy and will fit in with the team. Looking at the current season, what do you think the outlook is for this team? Well, it's always good in the springtime, Kathy. You know, uh, spring is a time of optimism, and everybody starts even. And I always say when you go to spring training, we have the feeling that the, the pitchers are going to win 20 and the hitters are going to hit 300. So all the optimism that uh, emanates from the training camps, you have to take with a grain of salt because the, the proof is on the field. And uh, right now, I think the Tigers have improved, and I do think they'll be better. And I don't know whether they'll be able to contend or not or reach the 500 mark. I certainly hope so, because we're new, a team that can uh, do something like that. What do you think about Coach Leland? Well, I think he's a fine, uh, he's a fine baseball man, and he's a good manager. He's got a great record, and uh, but personally, I like him very much. He's uh, got a nice personality. He's, he's uh, authoritative, and uh, yet he's uh, got a lot of soul. He's got a lot of feelings, and uh, I think uh, he'll make a good manager. I'm going to miss Alan Trammell a lot because he was a special friend of mine, and I saw him come along as a rookie and, you know, become a great player and become a manager. And it's